it is a lot easier to get through this when you don't piss away three quarters of your length at the very beginning. Here we go. No, 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 no! Use your little legs! No! <laughs> What's up guys and welcome to Candleman. Now before we get started, I needed to quickly say that this video is sponsored by Zodiac Interactive, the developers of Candleman. And to celebrate it coming out on Steam, they were actually kind enough to give me three copies of the game to give away to you guys. So if you end up enjoying it and you want to play Candleman on PC yourself, then you can either leave a comment on this video and like it, or you can tweet it out with hashtag Candleman, and I'll pick a few winners in a couple of days. So I haven't played the game at all yet, but I have seen the trailer and it reminded me so much of Little Nightmares. Like it has that same dark, atmospheric, like Tim Burton style that I love in games and I wish they would use more. And you guys know that I don't have a console. So even if a game gets super good reviews like this did, I just don't even know that it exists. But now that it's come out on PC, I am really excited to check this out. Chapter 1. Why does the candle burn? A little candle went to and fro. Oh my god, I'm so cute. I can't wait to hear my little candle feet make little candle pitter-patters. Alone in the darkness, a little candle burns. He looks at himself curiously. Why do I burn? Why am I different? Why do I have such adorable little candle feet? Looks like all of the other candles aren't alive. Interesting. Yes! <laughs> this game's already made for me. So I believe we can jump and we can burn. Yeah, why do I burn? The little candle with the little existential crisis asks and we can light other candles. Oh no, I'm littler. <gasps> Look at all my wax. Oh, I didn't realize that. Uh, I knew that the objective of the game is to light other candles because you can see that in the trailer, but I didn't know that I'm gonna burn myself to death, so eh. Okay. Yeah, you can see that we have a candle meter at the top, so we're just gonna light a bunch of candles and hopefully not waste the little bit of wick that we have left. I'm sorry, Little Candle. I like that name. I don't know if he has a name, but we're gonna name him Little Candle. Like Littlefoot. Except he has two little feet. Oh, it's dark. You see, that's the thing. I. I feel like there are going to be times where we're going to have to use Little Burn just to do the platforming. Ooh, what are you? There's four more, though. Do I want to go in that yet? I think I want to look around. Can I go over here? Uh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, you see what I mean? If I get all the way down, am I going to die? Because we saw another candle up high. How do I get to it? Yeah, how do I get up to you? It's not very fair. Maybe I can come back later with, like, extra candle abilities because I don't think I really missed anything, did I? Oh, maybe I can... Oh, oh, tricky. Okay, just gonna... Uh, so, oh, okay, there's one over here. I gotta give it, like, little, little bursts. It's so difficult to see anything. There we go. There's one. I don't know what the point of lighting all the candles. Maybe I can't leave until I've lit them all? We're gonna have to find out. Two more. It's all of them up here, though. Hmm. Can I climb? I doubt it. I don't have arms. <laughs> if I did have arms, I'd be way more terrifying of a little creature. Anything back here? Hello? Oh, oh, this is a platform. I can't quite make it. My little legs won't jump. Is that what you're for? Can I? Oh, I see. I can interact with the environment. Just rub my little candle crotch up against you and push you along. I do not have a whole lot of wick left. <laughs> There's no meter or anything like that to say how much I have in me. Oh, come on. I need to like... Uh, come on, just on the way. Up, up, 
Oh, come on, dude. Why can't you make that? Yeah, there we go. That's the stuff. Is there another one? Still one left. What am I missing? I have no idea where this last candle is, and I don't have a whole lot left to give. So you know what? I think eight of nine is pretty good. Is that okay, Mr. Light? Ooh. Okay. Seems pretty good. So is that all I needed to do? Oh, I see. So maybe I only need to get to the ending to advance, but I need to unlock all of the candles, I don't know, for another ending? I, I just, I don't know anything about this game, but it's definitely interesting how such a big part of it appears optional, but it might be not. Okay, his tender flame shone through the dark. So the game is like six to nine hours long, but I really hope that I can cover enough of it in this episode to show you guys more atmospheres because they aren't all, you know, like this, indoors around crates and wooden planks and stuff like that. That would be the whole needing to use your light to see anything. What was that, nine? Maybe the candles that I light are extra lives. Ooh, that's an interesting mechanic. So if I don't light anything and I die, is it just a permanent? Yeah, you see, you're already lit. So there's a, yep, there's a hole there. <laughs> cool, all right, I like it. But like I was trying to say, there are a lot of really cool environments in this. Some kind of psychedelic areas that I would love to be able to get to. I just, I don't know how long it would take me. It is so difficult to see. Okay, let's just, there we go, okay. Uh, I can see a candle over here. Boop. It is a lot easier to get through this when you don't piss away three quarters of your length at the very beginning. There we go. No, 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 no! Use your little legs! No! <laughs> it's nice that the candles stay lit because then it's easier for you to navigate your way back and you can also see all your little wax bits to follow where you were but I can't believe I didn't make that jump. It was right here. Okay, no, we're, we're fine, we're fine. I almost didn't make it again, but screw it. Can I go up here? Oh, it's like a, I see. All right, so we're just gonna do that. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, run, 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 run! Oh, come on! I feel like I can't jump as high when I'm heavier. I don't know if that's the case, but that'd be an interesting mechanic if uh, you actually had to burn yourself down to make certain jumps. There we go, okay, boop. All better. You can do that again for, I only need three more. Three more, oh my God, depth perception, why? Maybe the candles that I'm lighting aren't lives because they're not going up. Like I just lit a bunch and I still went from eight to seven. So I might only have nine deaths Per game and then I just die? I hope I don't have to find out. <laughs> Let's see if we can actually run up this straight. It's hard to tell where I'm facing because I'm so round. There we go, okay. What's the catch with you, nothing? Okay. So we're just gonna go over here and boop. I wanna say that I'm making friends, but at the same time, these candles aren't very sociable. I am unique and I guess my quest is to find out why I'm unique? Whoa, you see? Little nightmare flashbacks. We're on like some kind of, oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. We're on like some kind of ship maybe? If we're rocking back and forth? Oh, I really want to go get that other candle. Oh, uh, no. Okay, no, we're good. We can do this. So let's just do this. Careful, careful, careful. Oh God, you got mad hops. Spread the light. I just got an achievement for steam. Oh, down here. Uh, oh, this is how you get to the exit. All right. I don't know if I missed anything major. I feel pretty accomplished here. How many did I get? Oh, I got all of them. All right, so what does that give me? The path before him cold and stark. Oh, so maybe lighting them all expands on the story? I don't remember if that happened in the first one. Oh yeah, it didn't happen in the first one. You see, the path before him cold and stark, but a little candle went to and fro doesn't have a second verse. 
Alone he wandered the shivering deck, so we are on some kind of ship like we expected. I, I can only imagine this getting way more difficult. I even have the brightness cranked up a little bit just so that it comes across better in the recording, but I still can't see anything because I have really bright lights in my eyes. So the contrast is just the worst on my screen. All I see is dust and spit. Two down, okay. So it's all or nothing. You, you need to get all of them or else you're not getting the story. And I want the story. That's what interests me the most. My, my poor little candle needs to know why he exists. I can go further over here, all right. I think the one thing that I like is that there's hopefully not gonna be any giant monsters popping out and <laughs> blowing me. <laughs> That'd be hilarious, actually, if later on we encounter creatures that have an affection with blowing out candles. I don't know. What is a candle's natural predator? Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. Up, up, up. What's going on over here? Oh, no. Oh, come on. Freaking darkness. Okay. So you might get 10 attempts per level. And then if you die, I guess you just have to restart the level and all of the candles that you've already lit to go out. That seems way more fair. I thought this was like, I don't even know, like a, a New Game Plus style game where if you lose, you lose. Save file deleted. That would have been really depressing. Come on, come on. There we go. That's the stuff. Okay, so that jump is going to be a lot easier the next time. Because now I can see what I'm doing. Get out of here. Chains? No. We're good. We are good. Oh, stuff is starting to ramp up a little bit here. Nope, don't want to be over there. Careful. Careful. Okay. Geronimo! I'm gonna break my little candly ankles. There's gotta be something over here. There we go. There we go. There we go. Don't forget the darkness is terrifying, man. There's four left. Where? Okay, no. We, we can do this. We're fine. Fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, that's not the ending. I saw a light, and I just assumed it was the ending, but it was a lamp and a barrel. Hello, barrel. Maybe you're the natural predator of the candle. I would imagine getting rolled over isn't good for candles. There we go. Two more. That's the exit. What did I miss? Oh, I see one. Oh, I bet you I can... Did I get smooshed? I don't know if I got smooshed. Oh my god, that is really... I'm getting tossed around. I really want to get that candle, but I'm still missing one. Hmm. Okay, we, we can give it a try anyway, so I'm just gonna... Okay, careful. Careful. There we go. A lot of momentum behind this candle. I'm missing one. I'm gonna go back and check. Oh, crap, 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 crap. No, no, don't roll over me. Maybe it has to do with running on this barrel. Oh, it does. 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 Oh, come on. Yes. There we go. We learned that later. So I figured it out after. And then I can. No, no. Okay. I kind of want to see what would happen if I get rolled over. But at the same time, I'm more than happy having lit everything and getting my next story verse. This game is really pretty. There we go. Alone he wandered the shivering decks. Without purpose or aim, he trekked and he trekked. So they're not really adding all that much yet, but I get the feeling it's gonna build like an overall story. There has to be a reason. At last he reached the Grand Iron Gate. So maybe different worlds or different chapters, this might be the end of chapter one? Like I said, I would love to show you guys more environments, so hopefully the next environment is gonna be very different. Oh, oh, water? I think I just remembered what the natural predator of a candle is. Ah, oh, crap, okay. You're good. I haven't been anywhere near running out of light, so maybe I'll spend a little, little bit more time just burning and observing the environment and drowning. Come on, little candle. I know you have mad hops. Do I need to move this thing over? I don't know if I can because I'm pretty sure I saw a hole. Freaking tricked me. So what if we just give it a medium push? Oh, it keeps momentum. 
Okay, I really like that. So now I should be in the clear pushing you over here. And that'll help, right? There we go. Okay, we got gotcha. you. So there's no way I'm getting up there. How about we just move over this way? I'm still waiting to encounter some giant blowy creature. Please, please don't roll. Please don't roll. Please don't roll. Be cool. Oh, that doesn't look good. A whole lot of lily pads. I know they're not lily pads, but that's what they remind me of. Nothing in this game has a name, so I get to name everything. Uh, can I get over there? There's no way I can get over there. How would- Ah, oh, crap! Oh, I see. So I need to push you over. And then hopefully you're good enough. Good enough. Good enough. There we go. Okay. Gotcha. And I still got plenty of length, plenty of girth. I don't know if it respawns me full length or at the length I was when I died. Because if that's the case, I could technically just keep burning myself away. Ooh, it just got real bright. Why? Oh, it's moonlight. That was interesting. Oh yeah, look at that. That is really cool. So it's like the clouds must be moving or something like that. It goes dark again. Oh, I don't, I don't like that. I don't, no, no, no. Thank you. I need to see where I'm going. I'm not in control right now. Is this my stop? I think this is gonna be my stop. Thank you. I would imagine, yeah, there's gonna be a candle over here. Of course there is. Always candles. Who's leaving all these candles around? <laughs> Why is it my job to light them all? These are the questions that need to be answered here. Actually, what am I saying? His name is probably Candleman. It's the name of the game. <laughs> it just struck me. But screw it. I want to be Little Candle. Oh, oh, okay. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Another one. We got two more. It... Doing great. That doesn't seem like a very effective use of your crates, whoever's running this place. But then again, what do I know? I'm just a anthropomorphized candle. Ooh, buttons, why buttons? Okay, hold on, two candles, freebies? Last two candles are freebies. So what is this? I haven't seen any kind of code. Uh, is it just a decision where I wanna go? Let's go with, oh, I hate making blind decisions in games, you? You? How about you? I don't, oh, 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 hold on, hold on. Ah, I see. So I need to do this, then this. I like that they make this candle accessible. That's very important. I'm sure my rep will hear from these people. That was it, wasn't it? That, that was that was the code, open sesame. Square, circle, triangle, circle. There we go, okay. I must have screwed it up because I had already put some things in. Captivated by an illuminated new world. He wonders what has brought the abandoned ship back to life. And what mysteriousness lights the way ahead. Oh, I think this is the environment that I wanted to show you guys. At last he reached the Grand Iron Gate. A voice from beyond called him closer to fate. Oh, maybe it's not what I thought. Because I saw the little bioluminescent flowers and it reminded me of some stuff that I saw, like I said, in the trailer, but I don't recognize the stacks of books. Okay, chapter two, a call from afar. Bathed in light, the barge came to life. Ooh, this is very different. Okay, many books. Oh, and still darkness. So the light is gonna keep coming and going. Because of the moon, I suppose. The 
flowers will help me a little tiny bit. Not a whole lot, let's be completely honest. Eh, here we go. Whoever we'll stacked these, freaking genius, man. He also left his magic carpet behind. Oh, wait a minute. Can I... Okay, no, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. I'm a light little candle. What is this world? It's so... Like, I don't know, it's just whimsical. Oh, there's a candle down there. Okay, I think I can just hang out here, right? Eh. There we go. Eh, no, no, that that was probably not supposed to happen. <laughs> I think I caught it at my little knees, and the game was very generous in giving me that jump. Oh, I like it. Okay, you. There we go. And over here. So we're still on the ship. I guess we're just in some kind of weird vault library, I suppose. Oh, gotta go fast. Gotta go fast, like Sanic. There we go. What we got? Get up, 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 up. This is, it's just so strange. <laughs> I thought that the world was gonna be very practical, but this is anything but practical makes me think that I'm not the only weird thing in this world. I mean, I am a little running candle, so that should be expected. That's a big fall, too. Let's not test that out. Some bottles. One candle left. All right, let's keep an eye out. I'm also curious if there's going to be anything else other than candles that I can light, right? Liquor is pretty flammable. Wouldn't mind lighting a little bit of liquor. At all possible. Um, can I move you? I can move you. There we go. Thank you very much. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. There we go. Neat. Like I said, I'm I'm light. What do I get the feeling if I? Okay, no, it's not flammable. We're good. It's just magic uh, liquor dust. I don't know. Oh, I can't. Oh, I need to be up here. Okay, there we go. Eh. That's the stuff. Last one, got there. So now we can make our way over here. Careful, careful, careful. Come on. Yeah, we did it. I'm gonna have to make some kind of running jump here, aren't I? I just, I love the audio in this game. A little pitter patter on glass. It's so well done. There we go. And I got all of them, right? So I got every one of them except for the last candle in the first level. Bathed in light, the barge came to life as the little candle searched far and wide. But I think that's going to be it for this episode of Candleman, guys. And honestly, this is the kind of game that I would play through entirely on the channel if it weren't so long. And I don't want to make that out as a negative because if you're buying the game and playing it yourself, and like I said, it lasts six to nine hours for, I think, 15 bucks. Or it's 10% off on Steam right now if you want to pick it up. That's really good value. You want your games to be longer. But for a YouTuber, that just means that I would have to devote, like, 20 plus videos to it. And I just can't do that because it would take months and months for me to show you guys the entire game. So if you guys want to check it out, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description and I'll be giving away a few keys. And I just, I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Like, it's actually captivated me. I do want to play the rest of this in my spare time. So hopefully they don't take away my key or else I'm going to have to go buy it after giving some to you guys. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. GG!